Hello, Silver Grayscale here, getting back to more Shantae and the Seven Sirens, the Blind Run. It has now been a bit. Uh, okay, okay, I see how I need to go. So, you know, forgive me if I briefly forget stuff. But one thing I forgot to point out um, in any of the previous videos is the layout of this dungeon. The fact that the final save room is right in front of the boss room. Ah, that feels so good after the last one. <laughs> Where you had a bit of a little endurance to just get through beforehand. Uh, I'm gonna do a little refresh dance a few times here. Just so I can save at full health. Alright, time to go this way then. So, I hope everyone has had a... Uh, good... Um, I hope everyone had a good weekend. I had a pretty busy weekend, but a good one nonetheless. So, you know, forgive me if I suddenly get very quiet or do rookie mistakes, because I am still pretty darn exhausted from uh, from the weekend. Like, it's kind of the reason why I'm usually taking like Monday uh, off, off of like recording and playing multiplayer games or what have you. Mostly because of like the whole thing that it's after a weekend and well for those of you who don't know I within quotations work weekends. So get up here okay. We can't get up there. We need to go around. Oh, right. That's right. We need to go around this way. I forgot briefly, but I'm starting to remember again. Alright, we can easily get up there. Oh, yeah. It was this part that basically like, tricked you at the other end there to be like, Oh, you should probably use your... Uh, Bunker tortoise to get through here faster, but no, it's a lot easier to just run normally. All right, and back down we go, of course. <laughs> there we go. Hopefully we can find some hearts in these. Found one at least. Alright, so... I have completely forgotten the layout of this room and what is in it. Uh, we have to go this way. This just got a bit more complicated. Okay, we have something invisible. Um... Oh, it's one of the speedy guys. I am not gonna bother with him. I have way too little HP and, like, no auto potions. 
And this game doesn't have, or at least I haven't found it, or if, you know, if it does, I haven't found it. Uh, it doesn't seem to have a way to, like, quickly escape. Okay, this one can be really useful, so, uh, we're gonna get rid of that, and we're gonna take this one instead, the sickly uh, silverfish, because the refresh cost is something super helpful. Uh, Jug Buster we already have on. Okay, what? How much does this cost now? Oh yeah, that it. That is so much better. So. Take those again, take that, and leave. Where are we now? We're here, okay. Straight on. Straight on through. As they say in that one, um, door song. Break on through to the other side. Okay, wait a second, wait a second. Shit. Um, is it possible for me to make that? Yes, it is. So, let's do some more backtracking. Again, you know, nature of the beast of a blind project. You uh, don't know what's coming up ahead. And I wanted to play this blind because every single Shantae game I've done on this um, channel, while one of them was like semi-blind-ish, um, and the other was, you know, a game I've beaten multiple times, I huh because the bunker tortoise does not get us through um, the um, through spikes. Okay, let's refresh dance again. Because I'm getting real confused, because at the end of this... As you know, we reached that one um, puzzle with the cannons. Okay, so unless there is a cannon at the bottom that will take us... Oh no, there isn't. Okay. Let's back around in a circle. And that's only solving that puzzle. Ladies and gentlemen, the curse of a blind project. You have zero clue where you're supposed to go. Oh boy. Okay. There's nothing hidden here. Oh, wait, I'm an idiot. This totally works, though. Okay, I 
thought new test was going to be fast enough there. So, I apologize a lot for the running about here, but I... Again, this project is completely blind. When one of my all-time favorite YouTubers, Tom Fox, uh, played through this, I didn't watch the entire uh, playthrough at all. Like, I ignored that entire LP. Uh, and even during like his tomfoolery highlights, when I saw that it had something from this game, I skipped it. Because I didn't want to be spoiled. I wanted to discover things on my own. Like, the only time I have quote-unquote broken that was to look up because I was curious how far in the game we came. But there we go. What is down here? Okay. I'm starting to see how this works. Okay, that sends me to my death. Okay, so down. That way. There. And up. That takes me there. Okay. But what I want to do is I want to nab those urns there. The only way to get it is this way. There we go. That's a lot of the gems to spend once we get out of here. Okay, that... That's kinda cool. I'm not gonna lie. That That's kinda badass. Holy shit. Uh, Shantae, talk about traveling with style. Jesus Christ. And back up. Yes. God damn it. <laughs> okay, so... That's only for us to get back through there. But I want to catch... Here. Because I saw these. And I wanted to catch here because... I have a feeling... that this is how we obtain that last heart squid. Yes, it is! Booyah! Let's go. Back, uh, back to the room. Just zoom on by. been hilarious if we actually killed uh, some of the more annoying enemies with just like one dash like that. But that's the entire place essentially uh, explored. Only have one final challenge of a room left. And it's this room. Okay, I don't want to re... I don't want to use too much of my um, my magic because right now the only way I have to heal is the refresh dance okay so this is our final challenge uh, 
Okay, I see how this one goes. Um, that's bad. Okay. So going straight down there is not good. So we want to get to the one in the lower left there. Only way to do that... ...is to do that. Hmm. There we go, got it. Okay, so nothing of note there. Okay. So... Do a little refresh dance, and let's await our magic refill a bit here. And I think I want to save the boss fight for um, next video. I know this is a bit short, and I know most of this video has just been me reacquainting myself with my surroundings. But hey, you know, nature of the beast in a blind run. Most of you can relate when it comes to playing a game for the first time. You are going to run around looking like an idiot. <laughs> so yeah. Next time, we finish off the Sea Vent Lab by fighting the boss. See you then. Bye-bye.